Hey guys, just a quick video on how to install recessed door hardware. Before we paint this door and install it, I want to measure, mark and cut the recesses required for these recessed finger pulls or recessed door handles. In Australia, typically your door handles are between 900 and 1100 from the floor. If you're starting with an unpainted door, just lightly put your marks on with a pencil and these can be painted over later. If your door's already painted, I suggest putting a little bit of masking tape where you're going to be putting your marks. So one meter and 20 to the center of the door. On the center of your door handle, line those two up and this will give you the very edges of your door handle. Ours are going to be 25 millimeters in from the edge. Carry that mark through. Now we can see where that door handle is going to be sitting. Mark your screw holes. And then transfer a few marks across just here where you're going to be cutting out your timber. in here is going to be chiseled out. One thing I wanted to mention, most of these internal doors are hollow core, which means there's about 30 to 40 mil of timber around the perimeter of the door, depending on the brand. So try and keep your recessed door handle as close as possible to the edge so that you're guaranteed to be fitting it to a solid part of the door. Carry on like so, just chiseling out this kind of shape. We can see that this area is going to be the deepest cut. Sit it in there. You can, if you've still got too much timber in there, you can sort of seesaw it and you'll be able to feel where the fulcrum of your seesaw is, which is there. And you'll know that we still need to take more depth out of that. Once you've found that your door handle is sitting nice and flush all the way around, pre-drill your screw holes. That was maybe five minutes of chiseling. It's not a difficult job and it doesn't take too long. Once the door's painted and paint's dried, we're going to reinstall this door hardware, these recessed door handles. I like to put a little bit of construction adhesive, and I've heard you can use silicon, underneath the door handle before we screw it into place. It gives it a nice strong bond. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you got something from it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you want to and add any comments you like down below. You may have some tips and tricks for other people doing this at home. We've also got another video, how to install a sliding door. So if that helps you with your project, be sure to check it out. See you on the next video.